Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Riding Along with Dan. I uh, haven't seen you guys in a while, so I wanted to take time to do a video today to let you guys know the new ride has arrived in Jersey City. I'm going to post some pictures later of what it looks like. It's not lettered yet, but it will be lettered in the next couple of days. But it looks really, really cool. What a beautiful looking truck. So today, the other thing I want to talk to you about is... Uh, Another thing, bad habits, bad habits that we get into while driving front loader, roll off garbage truck. And the number one bad habit that I find that everybody's doing that needs to stop is on the phone. Whether it's Bluetooth or you're on the phone, you're holding the phone, you shouldn't do it guys. It's a distraction. You're out there driving that big truck, being on the phone, talking to somebody else, and trying to concentrate on what you're doing driving that truck it doesn't work you need to pay full attention to what you're doing you want to talk on the phone pull over take the few minutes take the time be safe talk on the phone put the phone away and they'll be on your way so that's number one number two i have five five big things i find are distracting and i know we're all guilty of doing it but here's number two number two is uh you know, uh, on the phone was number one. I mean, here's the other thing we all do. If you drive a front loader, we're all guilty of it. So am I. And I call it packing the blade while we're driving. So we're looking down, we're looking down, we're looking at the camera, and we're not fully focused on driving down the road, okay? You can't be packing the blade, looking at the camera to make sure nothing is coming over the blade. You can't be doing that while you're driving. It's okay, you know, when you're rolling from one container to another container, but you can't do that when you're driving because, again, you're being distracted while driving. You're not focused on driving down the road. You're not focused on what's going on in front of you. So packing the blade is another issue I find drivers, you know, got to get away from because it's another distraction as far as I'm concerned. And number three, eating and driving. We all do it. I have my Dunkin' Donuts coffee. Uh, you know, you have a sandwich, you have a croissant, whatever the hell it is that you're eating. You know, you're looking down to pick it up. You're looking down to get your coffee. I know everybody needs coffee. I need coffee. I need my Dunkin' in the morning. But that second that you look away and you're sitting in traffic, something could happen. So to me, that's another distraction. And also, uh, Another big one is tuning in the radio, okay? Some trucks are different. Some trucks, the radio is right over your head. You know, some trucks, they're in a, the center of the console. Some trucks, the radio is on the doghouse over here. So no matter what it is, it, it's another distraction for you guys while you're driving. I know it doesn't take that long to tune in your channel. You probably have your channels preset. But to me, it's another distraction while driving. And... Uh, Another thing is, I don't know how you guys do, but for you new guys that drive front loader, how do you ride with your forks? Because, okay, let's say you're making a right turn. You know, you got cars in the lane over here. You're making a right turn. You can't ride with those forks too low because you're going to clip the mirror on that car. You're going to hit that car. Those forks, the base of the forks need to be up level with the bottom of your windshield or if not a little bit higher okay but you cannot ride with the forks low they got to be up level with the bottom of the windshield and you got to keep them there every time you leave a stop every time you pull away from a container remember fold up your forks and bring them up level with the bottom of the windshield so those are my five bad habits that i can come up with that i see a lot of drivers doing out there and it's a distraction and it takes away from your full uh your full vision your full view it keeps your, your your mind is not on driving and you're not focused on what you're seeing in front of you you're looking away you're packing the blade you're tuning the radio you're eating you need to be focused and don't forget if you work for a company like i do and there are cameras you know watching you uh, in the cab watching what's going on around you and if you have an accident then you were packing the blade you were looking away from what's going on in front of you 
they're going to see exactly what happened because it's right there. Cameras don't lie. So all I'm saying to you guys is be careful out there. Be safe. Pay attention to the driving. It's very important to pay attention to what's going on in front of you, okay? Because you have a lot of weight behind you. You probably have a big load on. Uh, you know, just keep your distance. Be safe. Keep your distance. Go out there. Do your thing safely. Everybody wants you to come home the same night. And just be safe out there. Wear your vest. Wear your safety boots. You know, wear your hard hat when you're supposed to wear it when you're dumping the truck. Just be careful. Make sure the tailgate is locked. Make sure your hoses are good. Make sure nothing fell between the cab and the body. Just be careful out there and pay attention to what you're doing. That's all I'm saying. I don't want to see you new guys or older guys get in trouble for, you know, not paying attention for those couple of seconds that something might have happened. So, it's just another quick video, guys, on safety. You know I'm big on safety. And uh, I like to bring it to your attention. You know, I like to remind you. A lot of guys are probably saying, ah, damn, we know that shit already. But, you know, it's just uh, something I like to reiterate. like to remind you guys that, you know, safety is first. And again, I got some pictures of the new front loader. It looks absolutely awesome. I want to post those later on my uh, community page on my channel. Love the truck. It looks really cool. It's a 2022 Peterbilt. Really, really nice looking truck. It's got a lot of cool features, man. I just love how it looks. Really do. And I think you guys are going to like it too. So listen, be safe out there. Be good. Be careful. Be safe. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.